Discord has come full circle and became Skype by officially adding advertisement. So this sucks, but it was also bound to happen because Discord makes no money. In fact, they've never made money. This app is being propped up by investors. So at some point they had to do something like this. The actual ads themselves are not horrible. They're basically sponsored quests. You'll get a little banner on the left side of your screen. And if you accept that quest and complete it, you get a skin or item in that game. It is definitely a better way to advertise than just straight up ads. That was one of the worst things about Skype besides it being super clunky. I'm sure Discord will be fine and I will get used to closing these pop-ups. But if I pay for Nitro, which I do, I should be able to opt out of this. It is kind of ridiculous that you can't. That is the whole point of Nitro, I feel like. It's also ridiculous that Skype, a dead application, had features in 2014 that Discord still doesn't have. Like, why can't I pin a group chat or DM to the top of my list? That is such an obvious feature that everyone has been asking for since Discord launched. As of now, Discord doesn't have competition, but they will get competition if they get bad enough, and that competition will fix all the issues with Discord and eat another market share. That is exactly what Discord did to Skype. At one point in time, every person on the internet pretty much talked with Skype, and before that, it was TeamSpeak and Mumble. Just because Discord is currently the most popular doesn't mean it will stay that way. But what do you think? Let me know in the comments down below. Like, subscribe, new follow me on Twitter, add spends, one click, answer, and check out more of my content, and have a good one.